I'm Lucas Setter. I'm from Lexington, Kentucky. Uh, I've been cubing since 2011. Oh wait, I skipped. Yeah. Let me redo that. All right, got it. I'm Lucas Setter. I'm from Lexington, Kentucky in the US and I am 18 years old and I've been cubing since 2011. So my main event is 3x3 and my main is a Cubicle Labs Waylong GTS2M. All right, so my favorite cubing memory uh, was the party at Felix's house uh, <laughs> before the Sydney competition. Um, and my best cubing accomplishment was the 4.90 world record single for 3x3, the first sub five ever. My first competition was UND uh, 2011. Uh, it was like April 2nd uh, or something like that. Uh, I got a 32 second average, which was pretty good for me at the time, but uh, I was just amazed at like at people solving in 13 seconds, which is by no means fast now, but for me back then, that was mind blowing. So, pretty cool. That's cool. Yeah. So you kind of have to keep an open mind. Like when you're just starting out, you really need to keep an open mind. Uh, make sure you're trying out uh, multiple versions of algorithms uh, for a particular case. And also uh, try, to, try to watch walkthrough solves as much as possible uh, because the uh, very fastest cubers uh, have a lot to offer to the table in terms of knowledge. So when I began, uh, that was kind of during the rise of Felix, uh, back when he was setting world records like pretty much every every time he competed. So I'd say my idols uh, back in the day were Felix, Rowe, Kevin Hayes, Anthony Brooks, uh, Mats Volk, all of those legends. Uh, but now it's kind of interesting because I'm friends with all of them. So I still look up to them in a sense, but I, it's more like uh, more of a friendship now than an idolization. So uh, back in, in the fall of 2013, I started practicing two by two. I was learning EG, uh, so I was improving very quickly and kind of at the same time, my friend Rami, uh, he was improving very fast as well. So it was kind of like a, a competitive rivalry uh, between us. Uh, and he actually got the world record average back in March of uh, 2014. And uh, the funny thing is my first world record tied his uh, first world record at 1.69 seconds so we were tied there for a little bit um, so that was that was um, it was a great achievement for both of us and it kind of worked out because none of us was ahead of the other so we kind of got to share um, our biggest achievement in cubing for the first time so so team cubicle is is a uh, collaboration of a bunch of top cubers in the world. So all of uh, all of the incoming cubers uh, globally uh, can look up to these people and uh, be inspired by their immense speed and experience within the cubing community. Uh, but also uh, the collaboration also works to uh, motivate cubers within Team Cubicle to achieve new or reach new uh, reach new highs and break more records. So it's it's motivating for both. Uh, younger cubers or less experienced cubers and more experienced cubers in the community.